What's going on, beautiful people? What's going on? If you are here right now, that means you are a life path number eight. And you know what that means? You are the courageous successor. The courageous successor. All right, life path number eight. You are here to get the coins. <laughs> okay. Life path number eight is that number that is going to be financially abundant period okay financially abundant so don't be surprised if you just fall into money out of nowhere because you have that magnetic pull as a life path number eight to bring in financial abundance also i want to keep you aware that life path number eight be cautious not to be very materialistic because money are a number that the most high favors when it comes to financial abundance be careful not to fill yourself too hard be be humble, life path number eight. Number eight, you have that strong energy. I think of life path number eight similar to the life path number one because you guys have that go-getter attitude, that go-getter mentality, that go-getter energy. You feel me? So don't be surprised if you have that type of like inner power that gets things done. You heard? You heard? Okay. Life path number eight, be gentle with yourself. I know you may have that energy of like, you wanna go, 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 get some things done, get some things done. You are very motivated. You are very ambitious. You are very sure of yourself and where you want to go and where you see yourself being. And that is perfectly fine. Those traits are beautiful about you, but also at the same time, ground yourself. If life gets too crazy, go outside, put your feet in some grass, go to the beach, do something. And every one of the videos that I share is really important for all of them, but especially you, life path number eight, to ground yourself. Make sure you take that time out to get rid of all the busyness and all of that that's going on in your life. Careers that life path number eight may go into is entertainment, real estate, Anything that has to do with getting to the bag like that, that is the career that you should go into. Life path number eight as well. Be aware of who you partner with because you have an eye for good partners, good eye for making things happen. Make sure that you're partnering with whoever that has the same energy as you. What same energy as you. What's also really coming up really hard is ground yourself. If you ever feel like you're not able to call in the amount of money that you want, like I said, ground yourself. Be there for yourself. Really talk, uh, have somebody who you could talk to. In most cases, this could be a life path number seven, a life path number two. I like path number 11 that or even 22 any one of the master numbers 11 22 or 33 if you feel like you're stuck taught to these life path numbers they are more likely to help you because they could look at things from a higher perspective and broader perspective versus the linear perspective perspective that you may be coming from so seek a counselor seek somebody who you can confide in and talk to regarding business matters matters regarding, regarding money just somebody who you could really trust um also life path number eight be gentle with yourself be gentle with yourself, love on yourself. Anything that you can do to promote self-love, self-care towards yourself, life path number eight, do that. Because you are a go-getter, you are ambitious, you ain't taking no for no answer, you are about all your coins and then some, right? But you have to take that time out for yourself to reset, rebalance yourself, take trips, take just go out in nature, whatever that you need to do to maintain your level of balance, do that know that life path number eight you are a abundant being make sure that you are doing things from the heart and not from an ego perspective because when you do things from an ego perspective you're not going to get the results or the outcomes that you want because you're coming from an ego-based place do things from the heart Tap into your intuition. And number eight is a hyper-masculine number. 
whether you be female or a male, tap into that female energy, that feminine energy to balance out the big old spikes that you may have, that hyper masculinity energy, balance it out. And that you'll find that whatever business opportunity, career, um, situation, things will flow for you on a deeper level. So always remember to ground yourself. Stay within the good company of good people. Eat a good balanced diet. That's what I hear too. Eat a good balanced diet because you need fuel to keep that energy going. Keep a good balanced diet and get some good sun. So... That's how you can balance out the masculine energies that the life path number eight has. So I hope this has helped life path number eight, the courageous successor. Keep being courageous. Keep getting to the bag <laughs> and you will see financial abundance continuously in your life. Until next time, keep going. Courageous successor.